Oh! Oh! Oi! Oh my god! Hey! I've thought about going there many times to fish. Yeah, but not, not, you can, like, not comfortable. Yeah, the eddy's crazy, yeah. Ew! What is up? So I'm here with my mate, Vadim. Yo! <laughs> Ew! <laughs> So we're going to basically just get straight out there and fish. What do you reckon? Frothing? Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't know what I'm saying, he's from Ukraine. Let's go. Yo! <laughs> Let's go. Just tied all new fresh leaders, so hopefully they're strong. I think it's actually a tide change. I don't know if that's good or bad. Fish just there. Right there. Just don't get pulled off the edge. If you go over, <laughs> bye bye. Check your drag. Three, two, one. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Phew. Let's go. I don't even remember what lure I'm using. Floating 80. Swims really nice. Yeah, good one, eh? I like the pink colour because you can see it in the water. We only just got here actually and then we are setting up the tents. We got a few days here on the island camping. <laughs> Update, the tide is coming in really fast. We gotta get back to camp now before it's too late. <laughs> oh, made it. Camp's not far away, so we should be back in a. It's not far away, so we should be back in a. Oh, that cricket was sick. Should be back in a minute. This is a little camp set up, which didn't film that before. We just got here and we did a quick set up. Put the fishing gear ready and went straight down. Still some in there. So now we're going to grab the light tackle. What have you got? Epic little Jimmy. Ew. Cabby bag. Sold out, mate. A few tall salt eagers there. One, two, three, four. We've got this one, the P2. Salty Passion P2, mate. 20 gram floating. Phew. Let's get one. Let's get a fish, eh? Current gone, fish gone. No GT here yet, but bluefin, yeah. Finished fishing, eh? Go a mill house around the camp for a bit. Probably set up a bit of dinner. We'll see what happens. Who knows what's going to happen, mate? <laughs> Beautiful sunset behind me. Just going to um, rinse these lures to keep them mint condition. Just a little bit of water. Just so they're fresh for tomorrow. you got to make them look pretty for the fish, don't you? <laughs> How's the zone, though? Absolutely tropical. Do the dance. <laughs> Fall back. <laughs> Donkey Kong. <laughs> uh, we're having um, Megarang. Do you like Megarang? Yeah. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> Not that ready. You want oil? Yeah. Is it oil? Yeah, it's oil. Vadim's making a big cucumber salad. <laughs> Just gotta put some water in here. Put this a little bit. There's the noodles. <laughs> I burnt my hair. Singed my hair. The smell of it's crazy. Do you like the smell of burnt hair? Yeah. Here you go. Yeah. Smell it. 
Kevin Bacar. Yeah, Kevin Bacar, yeah. Water's boiled. Well, the noodles just boiled. I just wanted to walk out into this open view and show you how nice this spot is. Sunset time. Just looks crazy. Crazy, mate. Can I go back into the camp? Yeah, the colour of the ocean right now looks crazy, eh? So cool. How's the corn going? You got it? No. <laughs> it's enough. Time to eat. Island salad. Just corn, eh? <laughs> I'll eat it. Oh, that, the oil from the from the me is good. All right, eh? Hey. All right, we got our salad and noodles. Dinner time. <laughs> wow, the colours, eh? Big dark storm coming and colourful sunset. Contrast. Heaven and hell, eh? This is our dinner. Corn, some chicken in a can, and noodles. Good. That should taste yummy. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's definitely spicy, that's for sure. Chili, man. You gotta eat that, man. Alright, smash this dinner, then probably jump in the tent or something like that. Alright, uh, it's time for bed. Jumping in the tent. See you in the morning. You. <laughs> you. You, you. Sweat box, eh? <laughs> Tomorrow is the first full day. So I'll catch you guys then. Hopefully it's a big one. You. Definitely got a bug down my back. Far out. Oh. Whoa, time to wake up. A few massive marsupial things outside trying to eat our food and get in the tents. Vadim got scared once, that was funny. Gonna get up, have something to drink, and then we'll go fishing. Let's get out. Oh. I've definitely got stomach. Toilet. <sighs> How was it? Hot. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's so hot and like, the wind died off, eh? Hey? That's our breakfast. Hot water with granola. <laughs> How hot is it? Mm. Yeah, it tastes good hot, hey? That's Vadim style hot water and granola. It's actually good. Very early, but we're gonna start walking to the spot. Get prepared, because the sun does come up pretty fast. I don't know if my arms are ready. This can be my new channel, Broken Finger Fishing. <laughs> Every time you catch a fish, you break your finger. The question is, are you ready? I'm ready. Pop, pop. Oh, that looks like it's going to get hit, eh? I'm going to warm my shoulders up first with this stick bait. So as you can see, we are at the spot. Bright and early. First morning of the trip. Not the best current. But we're going to take our chances at the early morning bite. Later in the day will be a crazy current here. I might check my drag quickly. Oh yeah, strong. Strong, strong. But them's out there, big pop. Hope someone gets hit. No hits so far. 
No hit Nelly. No run, no fun. Yeah, there's like zero current, hey. But there might be something somewhere. All right, we're gonna have a few casts with the big popper. See if we can entice a monster fish. No current at the moment. So not too much fish flying around, but we'll see. The jam just hooked up. Oh, you, oh, what is it? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. What is that? Oh, oh, bro. Oh, bro. It's gonna come up again. That was huge. Wow. Yeah. He tried to eat first yeah. time. Oh, here. Yeah, bring it here. Yeah. Back to the rock. That's cool, that's a good looking groper, man. Yeah. It's a cool fish. I don't even know what that is. Yeah, it looks like Yeah, like a tuna mackerel thing. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty hooked, hey. In the mouth, it's pretty hooked. Oh. Oh what? And my leg didn't hurt my side. Boom. That fit like normally he looked like he wouldn't. He wouldn't really survive if that was Australia, our little mackles and stuff. He got pretty pumped, but that thing was real hardy. It's probably why the GTs are so big here. Because they got to chase those things for bait. First fish. Yeah. <laughs> you. Well, the popper's big. Good, I mean. Big pop. I don't think I've got the strength to pop this right now. Really liking this stick bait though. Looks nice and the action's great. <clears throat> oh, I had a hit. I wasn't looking. Oh, I'm getting hit by something. What was that? Maybe one mark on the lure. It might be worth having just a short break. I'm gonna jump in for the morning, morning shower, morning bath. We might go and film um, some of these cool looking fish off the front ledge. Oh yeah, there's heaps there, right? They're still there. I'm gonna try that popper. It looks really nice, eh? I think a stick bake's going to be a bit easier to swim, that water's actually moving so fast now. No fishy, no fishy. Where's the fish for them? <laughs> yeah. Put face mask on. It's getting sunny. Vibe test tonight. Yay! Oh! That was a good one. Yeah, Testing the vibe <laughs> and then just boom, straight away. We're well, yeah, again five more casts. 
and then we go back. All right, five casts and we're going back. One, two, number three. Last cast of the morning. Man, that current's hooking. I don't know if I want to even hook one. <laughs> Boom. No. Oh. Do I see something? Oh, here's a shark just here. Yeah? Yeah, right there, bro. Stay there, stay there, so you don't move. Bring the fish up onto the thing. <laughs> oh, bring the fish up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey! He'll come back if you want him to come back. <laughs> oh, that's easy. <laughs> yeah, better to have wow. Still good, yeah? Yeah. All right, probably go back to camp and do some light tackle. So you got the first fish of the trip. We almost had two fish on one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Groper and the tuna mackerel thing. <laughs> the lures look good though, that's for sure. Bit of a rinse off. Oh, we got some Coffee. Gonna get the gas burner on. Blows up big, eh? Big hair singe again. <laughs> I have no hair left by the end of the trip. I actually like the smell of it. It's kind of bad, but kind of good. All right, we'll boil this water. Oh. gonna drink this right away. Cheers. Smoking hot. <laughs> Might wait a little bit, but that's the coffee. The late morning coffee. We didn't have one when we got up. We just went straight to the ledge. That was well worth it. <laughs> yeah, well, he did get one fish, but yeah, really slow. I think tomorrow morning we might, because it's not the best run in the morning with the tide going the wrong way, we might go to the other side in the morning Tasty, but yeah, very hot. All right, we're going to the other side. Light and medium tackle. Let's go find our way through. We're gonna get to this desert zone soon, which sometimes it's full of water and sometimes it's not. It's just walking along and there's a snake skin. Little little snake skin so there is snakes here uh-oh <laughs> uh -oh. danger zone looks like a brown or some sort of oh whip snake <laughs> oh we're getting to the desert looks like it's clear there's no water just sand how you going back there <laughs> here we are in the desert lots of footprints I think they're deer, yeah? Those ones are deer for sure because they have those two big knuckles. Knuckle, knuckle. They're out here for sure. Somewhere. We're almost out of the desert. We were just saying that how good this would be if it was somehow full of crystal clear water. No one been here before and just fish everywhere. That would just be insane. But yeah, we're about to step out of here and finally get to the ocean it's a really nice place and i've been here before but i'm keen to see what vadim thinks about this spot that's it follow the goat trail it's looking so tropical today let's just go over there i'll show you this setup it's amazing oh right, you just gotta take a second to see I'm not walking, just standing here and look how fast that current is going. 
Wow. So yeah, looks good. Yeah. Really what do you nice. reckon? Yeah, I think we will get here some fish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Something out there. All right, we're gonna get ready and go fishing. It just looks amazing. And there's a little mini lagoon in there, which I've had a monster GT hit, smash a lure there, but missed. Um, but yeah, incredible little island over there you can swim out to. So that island we might go out to just for a bit of fun as well. But heaps of bluefin over there, big ones. Where do you want to fish first? The the I don't know, tip? Maybe here, maybe lagoon. Yeah, we can have a look at the lagoon. There can be fish already in there swimming around. I missed it. Yeah, man, I've never seen them before all the times I've been yeah, here. Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah, deer. Many deer. Yeah. Oh, that was just chilling here under the. Yeah, yeah look at them. <whistles> they fully stopped to that sound. Oh, we're going to try and spot some fish. I might even just have a blind cast, but the tide's going to come in more. It's probably going to get even nicer here. Yeah, Monster GT one day just here. It was like a 20 kilo GT. Oh, I just saw a fish move. Oh, is that a fish? I saw a squirrel. Oh, a hit. I had a hit. Didn't see what it was. Oh, bait everywhere. Lots of bait. Look at all that bait, bro. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I had one hit. Didn't even see what it was. You can fish off that little tip. Maybe I'll walk down there, have a couple. Ah. Oh. Sick spot here. <laughs> oh, turtle. Oh, bro, bro, bro. Whoa. Whoa. Big, big cold trout or groper. Huge one! No way! I think I kind of got scared and pulled the lure out of the water. Oh, I reckon we've spooked him now. He's probably gone. Damn! That was big. Yeah, we'll move out into the channel. That's wild. Oh no, huge um, cold trout or groper or something, but I kind of like freaked out when I saw it come up and I, it grabbed the lure but I moved the lure out of its mouth, so yeah miss. For snorkeling, you could um, you could go up there, jump in the water, and just drift all the way into the bay. Oh, there's something here. Oh, we're gonna have a few casts. Give it a crack. Oh, the breeze is beautiful and shade. That's nice. <laughs> it's hard to work a little properly. Got an itchy back, so I got a back scratcher. Ah! Big fish! 
Oh, Vadim just had a big fish try. We're gonna go up there. <laughs> just want to see if we can get to the other side. There's another beautiful bay around the corner. I don't know if we can get there. I think we can, yeah. You just have to go slowly, but you can make it. And now I stepped on that rock and walked around. Little death triangle in there, mate. It's slippery, so be careful. It's a full cave in here. Phew. You gotta get up onto that big rock, yeah. Oh, oh the tide! Phew. <laughs> yeah, I think on the way back we just go over the top. Woo! And the current off the tip here <laughs> is unbelievable. Dude, this is where you could chuck a lure out and just let it drift for so long. What? Woo! Oh, big fish! Oi, oi, oi! There's a big fish there. I reckon if you cast that way. Yeah, there's so oh, many yeah, around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's heat. There's two of them. Oh, there's so many of them, dude. Yeah, that's like a map, You can catch them like by the Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that's crazy! Uh oh. Has to be something sitting here, right? Eh? Oh, yeah, I'm on. I'm on. My first fish, bro. Ooh, the current is so strong. How is this current? <laughs> You're kidding me. Look at it swim. <laughs> Wow, that's a big one for what they are. It's a red throat emperor. Monster red throat. New lure, mate. Bye bye. Oh, he's still hanging there. <laughs> That car is so strong, he didn't know what to do. First fish of the trip. I think we basically go back, eh? It's like too strong to fish properly. I don't even know if we can get the lure. <laughs> oh, yeah. I thought I saw a fish. Big silver one. Oh, bluefin trevally. Oh, there's a bluefin. There's everything here. Ah! But you, you just can't get them to get the lure. The water's moving too fast. It's actually too crazy here. Yeah. So we're going to head out. Fadim got another fish. Cod. Feed it to the big grouper. <laughs> I got my waterproof bag on, so I'm going to go in the water. See if we can drift. Drifting, not really drifting. I think we're going to be further out in the current. I'm going out, eh? Am I? Sorry. 
<laughs> Imagine actually being stuck in the car right now, you'd die. Alright, that didn't really work, you gotta be further out, but that was crazy. Phew. No, you're gonna go down, just go down. <laughs> you have rocks falling on your head. Phew. All right, we made it out of that death zone, so we're gonna go back into the lagoon, but hop to the other side. Some nice rocks in the water we can cast out to or even swim out to. So we'll go check that out. Looks so good that there's no fish, eh? Crazy. Oh. Phew. Oh. Oh. Phew. <laughs> No way, you're on the reef. No, you got it. Still swimming. That's a good fish. Oh, reef day. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good fish. <laughs> Testing that lure. It hooked up basically straight away. <laughs> oh, we're on. Oh, might be getting reefed here in a second. The sunfish are better than nothing. Beautiful fish, beautiful lure. Here you go, mate. You. Perfect. Oh. Probably best to go up and over, I guess. It's pretty deep there, too. few casts in here. Definitely looks beautiful. I'll wait, I'll wait for you to cast. Could be, oh yeah, there's heaps of colourful fish, all sorts of stuff in here. Oh, oh did I just hit the rock? I don't know what happened then. Oh, oh, dude, I don't even know what that is, but it's, it, what, I just, what happened? I just got reefed in a set, like, bro? yeah, like, instantly, bro, that was absolute monster fish. What? I knew this spot looked interesting, and then boom, I didn't even have a chance to do anything. Yeah, it's close, Yeah, very big. Like the, I think that was a huge GT. Wow. Well, that was probably blew that fish spot far out. I can't, that was instant, man. Oh, well, that was a good little lure. It's gone. Huge fish, light tackle. <laughs> Instantly reefed. It had the hugest bow wave behind that after it hit. Oh, dude. Oi, man. Oi, oi, keep going, keep going. Oh, oi, that's the biggest. Oi, keep. Uh, twitch it, twitch it, twitch it. Oh, dude. Oi, man. Oi, oi, keep going, keep going. Oh, oi, that's the biggest. Oi, keep. Uh, twitch it, twitch it, twitch it. Oh, man. That's the biggest. Oh, I gotta get my. Oh, twitch, twitch, twitch. Oh, man. That's the biggest Maori sea perch I've ever seen. Oi, dude. Oi, wait, wait, wait. That's it. That's absolute monster, bro. Oh, dude. Dude. You're kidding me. There's fish everywhere yet. Yeah. Try and get it to come in. Have you got that minnow? Like 
Oh my god. Oh, it's still there. The biggest one I've ever seen. Maori sea perch, dude. Oi, oi. Oi, my god, bro. We gotta get him. He's over there. I can't believe he's still hanging around. I think he's, I don't know. That is crazy, dude. How big is that? Dude, I can't believe he's still hanging around. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna sink this down. Yeah, 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 there he is. Is he, where'd he go? Oh, here he is. He's, why is he still hanging around? Wild. Yeah, one of, that's the biggest Maori sea perch I've seen. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 man. He wanted it, but just not enough. You notice the tide's changed now. It's going back the other way. Oh, look at the blue kingfisher bird. Huh? That bird is so blue. It's kingfisher. So beautiful, eh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. If you had to hook that Maori sea perch, it would have been crazy. Yes! I thought it was on film, but it wasn't on film. Vadim just got smoked by a massive red bass. <laughs> We've had a few chances now. Um, this spot might not even be a light tackle spot, even though it's like really inside. Because the fish here are just huge. The biggest Maori sea perch I've ever seen was like hunting our lure. Here's lure, and then it just started swimming around here. It's gonna change this battery again. And yeah, we'll see how we go. Ew. Well, maybe we walk back around to the bay and see if we see anything in there. If nothing, we'll head back. Like head back to the bay area. Good little session here though. Well, we got absolutely destroyed, but there was fish here. Monster fish. Oh, we just got back to the lagoon. I can really see it from here. As soon as we got here, they even fish took off. I'm gonna head back, I'm gonna put face mask on so I don't get fried. That's like postcard picture. So beautiful. So we're gonna go from that tropicalness to a desert right now. And here we are in a desert. Ooh. I know I say this probably every trip, but it is literally this time a million degrees. <laughs> it's good to have Vadim here suffering in the heat as well. So we're gonna go and jump in the ocean right now. Let's get in there, refresh. You feel a million times better instantly, eh? Yeah. Like instantly. A million bucks. From a million degrees to a million bucks. <laughs> Island brew, mate. <laughs> I like cold coffee. That last trip with Joe, I was always leaving my uh, most of my coffee, and then when I came back to camp after fishing, drink it. I washed in salt water my sleeping mattress, 
dried it out in the sun because it had mold all over it and I was too lazy last night to clean it so I slept on proper mold so I don't know if I turn into a mushroom tonight that's why <laughs> full fungus <laughs> fungi cavi why did the mushroom join the party do you know that one why did the mushroom go to the party no. because he is a fungi what is fun fun guy is like a fun ah, person fun and fungi is a like a type of mushroom yeah. it's a stupid joke mate dad joke <laughs> it could be the most disgusting thing ever it could be really good corned chicken on bread <laughs> Yeah? Buttercream, I don't know. Yeah. Oh, it smells so hectic like cat food. <laughs> We're gonna give this a go. If we get a sore stomach, this is why. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Chicken burger. <laughs> I'm gonna have a bite. It kind of tastes like, um,. Kind of tastes like meat pie or something. <laughs> How is it? Yeah, good. <laughs> All right, we're gonna eat this and then go fishing. Sound good? No. No, no fishing anymore. We quit. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> oh, oh! <laughs> I just fell straight out of mine. I'm like just off the ground, I think. It still feels really nice though. Yeah. Oh, we're waiting for this current to start going crazy. But Dim and I are going to get out there and try and get one of those big bigs. But actually land it. <laughs> so yeah, we'll see how we go. Phew. Alright, I got this crazy new drone. Haven't flown it yet. I've got to work out how to do it. I forgot to charge this before we came, but there seems to be a bit of battery in there. Wow, the screen's so much better than the phone. Next, agree. I don't have Wi-Fi. Yeah, you need Wi-Fi, eh? I don't have internet here either, I don't think. Yeah, I can't even fly the drone because you need Wi-Fi to set it up. That's a fail. Brought the drone to the island and can't even get it going. How bad is that? Why can't you just fly this thing without, like, maybe you don't have Wi-Fi like me. <laughs> There's no Wi-Fi on this island. No, at least you just bought it before we came here. That's, that's stupid. I really wanted to get the drone up there and see if we can see all the GT hanging around, if there is or none. But there probably, it looks like there'd be a lot. So yeah, well, that was a bit of a fail. Well, let's just go fishing then. It's looking really, really good. So we're just going to get straight into the casting. Let's get out there. Hopefully, I well, really, really hope we get one. Even if either of one of us gets one, it'd be even better if we get one each. But yeah, let's get out there. Let's try. Test our luck this afternoon. Cast, bro. It's, oh, big. What was that? I just saw something black. Oi. You're on, big, huge and black. Just focus, keep the line tight. Keep the line tight. Not too much drag. That's big, bro. Big, really big. I'm gonna try a double hook up, because there's a pack of them. You keep fighting. You know your knots, if you have to tighten up more, tighten up. Wow. Cool, walk to the edge. Don't let him go to the reef, bro. That's a big fish. Don't let him go to the reef, bro. Rod tip up. He's going to the reef. Oi, oi, you need to come left. Oi, left? Yeah, yeah, you need to go left, dude. Your line's on the reef. You gotta go left. 
but you need to go more left dude like even loosen off walk back i mean out what you gotta walk out to that tip walk out to that tip because you gotta see where your line is and it's on the rock keep going out walk out bro you might be i don't know where your line is now but you were definitely on the rock before yeah can you feel rock yeah oh no that was a big black gts dude i think yeah yeah dude wow yeah walking over here was a bad idea i meant walk to here to the corner Woo! that was huge dude I oh no way that was a monster that was a pack of them i wish i had have had a sh i was just getting ready to cast too man this spot is crazy for the big fish <laughs> you just got absolutely smoked give me a feel of your drag Oh, you loosened off already. This yeah. Nothing to do. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Massive. Yeah, very big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A few black GT. Yeah, there's a whole pack of them. That's crazy, bro. Still, no one has managed to land a GT here. Oh. How do you feel? Yeah, like <laughs> nothing good. Nothing good, I. Eh? But how is the power of the fish? Yeah, like crazy. I cannot stop. Yeah. Everyone has nothing on these fish. They're just that crazy. I've put so much hurt on the actual fish that's broken my terminal tackle. I really want to get revenge and get a hook up. So hopefully we see another bust up and can cast. Easy hook up. But I've been casting so much and just nothing. So yeah, hopefully see him bust up again and easy cast into him. Boom! Because that was heat. A whole pack of black GTs. Then he just cast it and then big one came out from the park and just went... Gone. Ski. Yo! Oh my god, they're huge. Big ones. So far away though. <sighs> huge GTs just then. Oh, oh, long tom. We don't want the long tom. Oh, man, there's some big attacks going on over there. Ah. Quickly draw, try the big pot. Oh, there's a hit just here. I think it's tuna though, maybe. <coughs> What? No way! Baby squid. Just on the rocks. Mm. Is it dead? Yeah. He's not looking alive, yeah. Can use him for bait. Yeah. <laughs> Something will eat it. You! But him's on the vibe. Just testing it out for the first time already on. They're so cool, dude. That's such a crazy fish. And they look really strong for what yeah. they are. So thick. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Have you got pliers? I can hold him here and you can get pliers. Yeah. They're so much stronger than, um. oh, yeah. Let him go here on the rocks. Look. They're, they're crazy fish, dude. Yeah, they're so strong. I've even got scales on my hand. He's on again. <laughs> Woo. Man, that vibe's going off. I'm gonna cast. Ooh. Yeah, look how cool they are. Yeah. That's awesome. So if anyone knows what that fish is, give it a name, because I'm not really sure what it is. Oh, bro. That's okay. <laughs> 
See that? Yeah. Do you know why? Because he smelt the, the blood of the fish. Oh, yeah, I oh, know it is for sure. That's what happens. He was coming right here to see where what was going on. You can see that so clear. If you hook one and you put a hook in it and chuck it out, you, something's gonna take it. Either a big GT or a shark, yeah. Three fish in a row on the vibe. Same thing, eh? Yeah. Probably same thing. Yeah. Should I get some water footage of it swimming in? Ew! That's an awesome fish. Vibe test to know. Yay! Oh! That was good one! Yeah, Ew! Oh, that's a good one! Ew! That's probably better for a um, iPhone one, yeah. Yeah. I forgot the camera going to fly, but that's alright. I'm going to Oh, shark just there. Oh, yeah. oh shit! Oh no! That was a new one. Oh, I didn't get that messed up. Yeah. Yeah, that's a white tip or something, that one. It's not even a black tip. It's cool. Yeah, okay. Go swim a bit forward and back, not a show. Yeah. And then when you land, go push him. Oh. You gotta push him, grab his tail and push him. Right here, like this. God, I'm sorry, you stung me, I think. I went, I went to grab the fish and something just went boom into my arm. He's for sure dead. Oh, his gill's broken, that's why. One of his gills is ripped. I don't know what, what these are, but we're going to try and eat it, eh? Barbecue fish. Tonight. Ew! Yeah, it was right here in front of like right on the rock. No GT hits all day for, oh, maybe one on light tackle. Yeah, maybe we head back, eh? Huh? Maybe we go back. Yeah, I'll have one more. Sometimes they're really aggressive towards lures too. Oh, there he is. He's definitely curious. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 
Yeah. Big one. Bring the fish up onto the bank. Oh. <laughs> Bring the fish up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He'll come back if you want him to come back. But I think you record, yeah? Like yeah, I was recording. Yeah. I was just holding the camera real weird, but I was recording. Yeah. Good size, yeah? Yeah, it's a good one. Uh, ah. The fish will be sweet, he's gone. The shark really got scared then. <laughs> Alright, well that's the end of that whole day, really. Vadim got us some food. We could have had like a million of these. <laughs> the shark almost had one just then. We had lots of opportunities today of getting some big fish. You fish like tackle to catch heaps of fish. And then the big ones come and you get smoked and then you're like, oh. I probably should have cast it at the same time. I wasn't really thinking. I was just like, wanted to see him hook up. But if I had a cast at the same time, there was a whole pack of them. And I would have had two times the chance of getting another good fish. Just re really, I'm still trying to get a good fish from here. feel like the next one I hook, I'm going to catch it. So yeah, maybe tomorrow. Alright, we're going to head back to camp, pack up all our stuff. So many, eh? So good. And how's that box? <laughs> Nice ones. Those vibes are going off today, eh? Yeah. So many fish. There's this one. There's this one. Yeah. That's a really That's nice second lure. Cast and lost. So good. Purple one lost on the red bus. Mm. That cavy lure is absolutely way too small. It needs to be that size on that lure. The logo. Yeah. Yeah, sick. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's for the biggest fish out in the ocean eh? Alright, let's pack up, head back. Eww. Back to the base. The fish is shining. <laughs> um, just throw it. Fishy! Here, yeah, fishy, fishy, fishy! Don't grab that close rock again. Remember, you gotta grab the big far one. I think last time you grabbed like there's a little one at the front. Oh. Crocodile eye. Yeah. Big. I don't mind holding it. Get some wood and make a fire. Grill the fish. That'd be nice. Salting up the fish eh? Yeah. Bit paper, onion inside, yeah, and lime. That'd be nice. Yeah, it must be super nice. Yeah, that was really crazy. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta get the fire going. Build her up. Then we'll get the fish on the big cook up. Phew. Let's go. Smoky, eh? Whoa. Whoa. Once this fire, whatever. So once this fire goes down a bit, charcoal's gonna be red hot. Then we're gonna lay the fish on the charcoal. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm really interested to see how this fish tastes. Looks like it should taste really good, so we're gonna find out. <laughs> Fresh fish is pretty much always good anyway. Awesome. We need a stick to flip. Oh yeah. Well, we're gonna try and check this fish properly. 
Wow. Put it on this. I have to try and figure out how to pick the fish up. Check this side. To me, it's looking pretty good. Think good, eh? Yeah. 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 Ew. Oh, it smells good, eh? In the hood. Big dinner, eh? Yeah. We deserve it for how many fish we lost. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it looks so white. It's white meat, so it has to be good. It's good. If it's red, then you're skeptical. <laughs> wow. It's actually really good. If there's more of these tomorrow, we're going to keep another one for sure. Yeah. Well, my favorite eating fish is a Spanish mackerel, and this is kind of like a blend between a tuna and a mackerel. You like it? Yeah. Bagus. So bright, eh? Oh, you like it? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to dig in. Big feed. After that, we've even got some noodles in the pot. Big fuel up for tomorrow. It's going to be on. Yeah, look at this thing. Oh. Mm. Oh. It's no joke. It's legit fish. Some people might just say it tastes amazing for video, but this actually tastes amazing. Mm. Wow. Yeah, with lime, so good, eh? Lime and fish is just amazing. That's the final side of the fish. Look at that chunk. All the juices. <laughs> so nice. That's proper feed, mate. Big feed. All right, in the tent, and it's a good night. Catch you tomorrow situation. Like always, the wind stopped at night when we needed the breeze to sleep no wind during the day wind night no wind so it's gonna be a hot sweaty sleep that's for sure good night and see you guys in the morning you that's crazy bro wow <laughs> <Not at all. laughs> Um, Vadim just got stung by that on your back. Where is it? Huh? Where did it get you? On your back? On your hand? Yeah, because it sits in my oh, back. Oh, it was on your I, back. And I want to remove. And what? my finger, like, still not good. Feeling, like, super <laughs> painful. So we've been in bed for about an hour. Vadim yells out. He's like, oh, I got bit by something. Yeah. Hopefully it's not a scorpion. And I'm like, nah, there's no way it's a scorpion. And there's a scorpion. <laughs> that is so crazy, man. And it's actually kind of like psycho looking scorpion. Where is it? You gotta get it out. How it's coming? I don't know, eh? In something? In like some clothing? Oh, we're gonna try and get rid of this scorpion. <laughs> scorpion in your tent, dude. Bit you on the hand. That is just so unbelievable. I don't know. That's really crazy. Yeah, watch out inside your hammock tomorrow if you sleep in it. Because that's where I saw the one the first time I came here. Alright, go to bed. Oh. <laughs> Alright, there's been things walking around the tent all night long. It's probably the hottest sleep ever. The dem got bitten by a scorpion. So we'll see if he's still alive. <laughs> it's still pitch black. There's a huge storm out there. I can probably show you some lightning. And you can probably hear the thunder. So maybe it's going to rain in a minute. But yeah, let's get up and get out of this tent, eh? Whoa.
Did you turn into a scorpion? Still alive, eh? All right, this is our breakfast. Granola with bananas. That's really not too bad. A little bite. We need to get as much energy, energy as we can. Last night was horrible. <laughs> Scorpion King over here. <laughs> Said his arms pretty sore, kind of numb from the bite. Can't believe it was in your tent. Mm. Still can't believe that. Alright, we'll smash this and then we're gonna get over to the ledge. Hopefully there's big ones everywhere. This morning just all jumping out on our lures. That would be epic. Well, Vadim's still getting ready, so I've walked down. I'm gonna have a couple of casts at the front of camp. It's very early. I don't think I've ever seen it this shallow. We'll try and cast where I think the channel is. See if something big comes and hits early in the morning. Oh, that lightning was crazy. We're pretty lucky the storm went, basically went around us. <coughs> you ready? I have one more. Yeah, so low tide, I'll have one more car. Oh, something just attacked. Did you hear that? Yeah. I don't know if it attacked my lure or just attacked. Oh, no, it attacked out back a bit further. All right, sweet. All right, we go. Yeah. Gets bright really quickly here. We've been walking for about five, ten minutes. Almost at the spot. Oh, as you can see, it's extremely shallow oh snapper just saw a snapper swim past we're gonna start casting straight away so calm and nice good luck I right, cast good all right first cast mate at the G spot where it's hasn't ever been a happy ending <laughs> the only g-spot that has no happy ending eh? right here <laughs> we have small fish that's for sure there's a lot of them jumping out oh bluefin big bluefin just followed right to the edge No, but it's super shallow, like near the rocks. You understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> oh, I had a strike. That was a GT, I think. Completely missed the lure. We'll go back out that way, though. Can still see that it was a pretty big fish. Can still see where it hit. Gotta give us a fish for this heat. Some reward. No money, no honey. This could be a mistake, but there's a ton of medium small fish, so I might try and cast smaller lure. Here we go. Come on. Yeah, maybe. I'll have to feel it with my hand. But I'm going to try and catch a fish. <laughs> Just need to catch something. And then we can go back to big. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy for a popper right now because there's no noise. That's the only noise in the whole ocean right now, so something should hit that. Alright, I've let this sink down for a long time. We'll see if we get dog tooth tuna. 
Something different would be cool. This is coming up from maybe, I don't know how deep it is, but it's coming up. Hopefully something deep sees it. No hit, looks incredible. Oh, I had a hit. Just a hit though, no hook up. Maybe the small vibe is gonna go off. Oh, you're on. <laughs> you got one of those things for sure. Whoa, well oh, there you go, easy release. Yeah. It's an aquarium down there, right? Eh? So much bait, but no hits. Put a tiny lure on. Not really the right setup, it's P4. But hopefully we can still cast it. Probably all the small fish have run away now that I've changed to this. So they were busting up everywhere before. All the small fish went away. Well, update is, current absolutely stopped. There's like no movement and no fish, no run, no fun. I've actually got like a pretty injured elbow, basically a broken finger from wrestling. So every cast with a heavy setup is painful on my finger and elbow. So I think what we're gonna do is gonna go back to camp, have the morning coffee, and then go check out some beaches that we haven't seen, I've never seen before. Let's head back to camp. You what? You're kidding me. It's a massive fish in this coral here. After a bit of a Alrighty, we had our bit of a coffee break and we're heading over to another part of the island, like I said before, somewhere new, never been there. Light tackle, P2, and we have ultra light tackle, super whippy rod, Ew. top water. This fishing will give my arm a bit of a rest so we can hopefully recover a bit for the big GTs later on. Uh, we're gonna venture over that hill. Big reindeer, goats, and scorpions. <laughs> oh wait. What trucks are they? They're actually huge, eh? Deer again. They must sleep under these trees in the shade. I'm not actually sure how far this is, but maybe we we're there already. We'll have a look over this ridge. Whoa. Crazy, bro. Actually, kind of dangerous. Standing on that edge. Yeah. Thought I can see fish under that rock. Maybe the next bay is better than this one. All right, we're at the first bay. I think we might go check out the next one. It's much bigger of a beach, I think. Whoa, look how pink this sand is. And there's either a huge shark or a massive stingray on the beach there. We found some sort of an entrance, I think, to the beach.
And here we are. All right, let's go fishing. I might go the ultra light. <laughs> Get reefed. Whew. Here we go. Top water. Walk the dog. Oh, the rod broke, man, on the cast. All I did was cast and the rod broke. You're kidding me! <laughs> no way! Well, we bought this cheap rod to do ultralight fishing. That was my first cast and the rod snapped. First cast. <laughs> that is so crazy, dude. So good. That's just unbelievable. Indonesian rod. Bagus. I'm gonna try and fish it with two guides. Oh, right, we'll see if this works. Probably not. It works. <laughs> oh, I need to find shallow water further out there. Here we are. Oh, we're going to get a fish here, eh? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Yes. We're on. Top water, walk the dog, half a rod, beautiful fish. That's sick. Whoa. Let's try to reef me, get her in. That's cool. That's big, pretty big for an ultralight tackle. Perfect. Oh. There you go. Oh, something big. First fish on Walk the Dog, that's rad. Oh. Climbing around, there's actually a full cave here. Wow. Crab. I think at the moment, at the moment we can get through because the tire's not in yet. Oh, crabs falling everywhere. Ah! Huge fish or something. We're in a cave. We're gonna try and walk through before the tire comes up. Ah! Oh, my back is touching. That's really cool. Ah. Any any longer we wouldn't have been able to get through that. Ah. Crazy. Phew. There's another cave. Big cave. How's that view? Oh. Wild. Oh, let's go change this rod. That's a joke. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and by the way, that's why the pink is sand. Uh, <laughs> that's why the pink is sand. That's why the sand is pink. Because of this stuff breaking down. So, in theory, it's not really a good thing to have pink sand. It's dead coral. How'd you go? Huh? How'd you go? I caught like a two grouper and saw one baby JT. Oh yeah, cool. Yeah, and many longer. 
on the phone. But yeah, like, nothing crazy. No, I think we should maybe just climb up and check out what's on the tip and around the corner, maybe. Wow. Crazy, yeah? We can fish that tip over there. There's so many fish over here, it's crazy. What? There's fish everywhere down there. Oh, oh, oh dude, there's like, how many did you see? Thanks. Nah, there's like eight or something, there's so many, bro. <laughs> They're going into the bay. Oh, this is crazy little spot. I'm gonna leave this one up here. There's a lot of fish just swim past. Oh, probably gonna slide. Wow. Ah. A lot of fish in here. Fish everywhere. They're following? Oh, you're on the beach. <laughs> Oh! Oi! Oh! Oh! Oi! Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Oh my god! Oi, bro! <laughs> that was the craziest thing ever! I had a hook up right here. Well, that was some wild action. I had I actually hooked one just here and it dropped off, dropped off the lure. Well, that was pretty cool action while it lasted. Almost had a... Oh, I hooked up to a bluefin actually. And then just pulled the hooks. But yeah, we're going to keep walking over that way. The dim's on the beach over there casting. Chopper of speech ever, ever. So yeah, let's climb back up this. Because these leaves are everywhere, it's just so slippery. It's like a layer of ice. I was saying the most tropical beach in the world and then you come up here and you look at this how many plastic it just keeps going back plastic bottles everywhere wow maybe it's not the most tropical beach in the world that is Legit ridiculous, eh? Hey? Yeah, crazy. I mean, it, it is naturally very tropical, yeah. but man have destroyed. Did you hook up? Bluefin, damn it! Oh, it's still hell tropical in here. Phew. 
Bike going everywhere. Just one of those um Spanish flags. What I, I got before. The water is so clear, you can see him. I'll catch him again. <laughs> he went under there. Let's check out the cave. Another cave. Woo! Back to the desert storm. Lots of footprints here. That might be quicksand there. Yeah, that's interesting. They're big, eh? Oh, they're footprints. Yeah, it is. Not, not too big. Yeah. Same. They would have just come in on that beach and then walked here. Yeah. Well, we found where the quicksand is. That actually can be really dangerous. Look at the feet. <laughs> that smell like perfume bro <laughs> my bro what is that I saw it hit I saw it hit um oh dude are you are you out there oh Whoa! Oh, I'm still on. Oh, bro. I'm off now. I was on still. What the? That. <laughs> You're kidding me. It's crazy how fast the current moves here, eh? Oh, uh, we're gonna jump in for a saltwater drift. <sighs> Woo! Pretty fast here. Oh. Oh. That was cool. Still drift. Alright, there's been no more fish since that GT hookup. We only had a quick stop here, now we're going to walk back to camp and um, relax for a bit for this afternoon's hopefully psycho session. Big GT spot. So yeah, let's get into it, eh? Yew. We got our lunch. Tuna chicken. Mega rank. <laughs> Looks spicy, eh? Here we go. Super. How's the view though? Oh, 
You're kidding me. I landed near it and scared it. That's crazy. It got scared of my lure. Hammock life. If we see another fish, I'm gonna jump up and cast. Not on top of the fish this time. <laughs> well, it wasn't really that close to the fish. It still got scared though. It's not even high tide yet. Oh, maybe it is high. I think it's just changed, so a couple hours and that current will be crazy out there. Crazy. Oh, we've had a nice little rest at camp. Now we're heading to the spot. I really want to catch one of these little Spanish tuna mackerel things that Vadim's been catching. So I got the light light set up today, or light set up. Parrot fish is eating coral down there. It's where the water is just so clear today. Moving now. Boom, boom. Yeah. Boom, boom. Yeah, the current's really flowing now. There's those tuny mackerels out there. Extreme tight. So much bait just went psycho over there. You can see really well from up here, but there's no fish to see coming. <laughs> Ah, oh, dead. Uh, we're not really casting because we're just watching to see if we see something. The current is just like fully gone. Maximus, <laughs> Optimus Prime. It's just like crazy. We haven't really seen anything hit the surface in a while since that current picked up. Oh, that was big. Oh, there's some big ones in there. Woo. I feel like we're going to get something this time. Crazy that nothing hit. Must just be in the wrong spot. Oi, 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 oi! Oi! Oi, oi, oi! Wow! Oh my god! Oh, come on! Ah! So many GT! Not that far away. Well, let's get back to the main ledge. I had one opportunity and I missed it by two or three seconds. Ah, the GT was too far down the current. One more cast and I reckon I'm done. Save energy for tomorrow. <laughs> Save it for tomorrow. Well, that was a bagus afternoon, full of nothing. <laughs> so yeah, go back to camp. Maybe if I feel excited, we can do some fishing at the front. Ew! <laughs> a little bit later, like after 15 minutes. Yeah. So this is what we got left over of food. It's our last night here. Granola, crackers, one orange, a few packets of meagerang, 
an onion, buckwheat, <laughs> which Vadim's cooking now. Have a buck, eh? Yeah, must be super nice. Mmm, looks good. We're gonna be a stuff. Gonna eat the bread now with the beans and some buckwheat. There it is, baked beans on bread. Oh, it's dripping everywhere. No. I've already kind of got the fart, so now I'm definitely gonna, definitely gonna have the fart. So, beans make you fart. Baked beans are good for your heart. The more you eat them, the more you fart. <laughs> have you heard that? No. Here we are, Vadim special buckwheat with chili chicken. <laughs> You like buckwheat though, mm, right? Yeah. I don't even know if I've had buckwheat in so long, so I'm interested to have a have a bite. Yeah, good. The buckwheat itself has a bit of a flavour. Hmm? It has flavour. Yeah. Probably healthier than rice, so I... So last night here, every night, we have to blow up our mattresses because they're that bad and old that the air comes out. That's my bed. I got a bear thing for a pillow. <laughs> All right, big pass out now. Catch you guys early in the morning. Last GT fishing session. Hopefully I finally get a hit. <laughs> that would be good. All right, see you guys tomorrow. You. All right, good morning. It's the... Uh... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wakey wakey, eh? It's um last morning here. Let's get outside. See what's going on. Oh. I know there's some fishing boat cruising around. There's a fishing boat, so we'll see where they are. Huge one. Massive fishing boat over there. <clears throat> the tide is extremely low. Uh, it's obviously pitch black. Turn the light off, check out. Very early. Pitch black. Uh, we're going to get ready to go fishing. We'll have a little morning snack and then pack up. So yeah, I think I was dreaming that we were catching big GTs, so hopefully the dream becomes reality. Rawr! It is the last morning here. Still stars out in the sky. We're just getting ready, making sure everything's good because we don't want to miss the opportunity of landing that big one. Looks beautiful. So yeah, let's just cross our fingers. They're there. Ready for anything. <laughs> I'll take a I'll take a bluefin even right now and be happy. <laughs> Haven't Cap Dog hasn't had pretty much any opportunities at the big GT over here. Zero last morning. So hopefully the pop pop can draw something up. Feeling good? Let's crack it. Feeling good, like I should. All right, yeah. yeah. Let's go.
Whoa. Don't want to do that if I get a fish, slip straight away. Straight in the water. If this if there's not a fish in here, it looks too crazy, eh? Hey, Mr. Fishy, where are you? <laughs> Same place as yesterday. Okay, well, I'm not gonna catch you. Hey, Mr. Fishy, where are you? I'm the same place as yesterday, and you're not gonna catch me again. Okay, I'm just gonna go home with no fishy, not even a strike. Yeah, cool session, bro. Cool session, bro. Hey, Mr. Fishy. Why don't you want to play? I just catch you and release you anyway. Even a shark. Come on, sharky. I just need one that's passing by. 100 kilo dog tooth tuna. Oh, we had one hit. We had a strike. He completely missed the lure. But it means there's something up there. <laughs> wow, bro. Ooh, that's a big GT. <laughs> oh. Is that a fish? Look at that sky. It's beautiful. One more cast of the popper, and then we're going to switch to a stick bait. Pink sky, pink lure. Like something literally just there. Oh, bro. I don't know what they are, maybe they weren't GT. Uh, has to be GT in here. So I quickly try the light tackle. I don't know what they are, but there's even fish just here. <laughs> Even just a small fish to start the day, come on. Oh, nothing's hitting the light tackle either. What? <laughs> Was that one of those fish or a GT? GT or bluefin, something like that, but yeah, crazy. He coming, like follow, and when I start to drop, he jump like BAM! and go to the rock. Looks so yeah. Looks so cinematic. Yeah. The sky and everything. Yeah, but I have like recording. GoPro oh, you had it on. I mean like GoPro working. That's cool.
I reckon that's probably the most cinematic sky I've ever seen. Look at that. Sunrise there. Big rain cloud over there. It just looks that amazing. Now we just gotta get a fish. Imagine a fish right now holding it up with that background. Let's get out there. Woo! I mean, I've been out there for a long time. Still no GT hits. Lots of other fish. Don't know what they are, like tuna or something. Whoa. Yeah. And last hit was like my hook spinning, like lure spinning, and he jumped, yeah. I'm gonna have a break while this boat comes past. Grab a drink, grab my sunnies. So bright now. There's a ton of bait just sort of slowly swimming up current, so we're waiting to see if they come all in here. There's a bit more out there. Because that, I think, is Fusiliers, and there's GT every now and then coming up underneath. If they come here, we're gonna start casting, that's for sure. It could be the lucky chance. Lucky last chance, mate. It's been a very beautiful morning, just with no fish attached to a lure. <laughs> Crazy hot now too, eh? The sun in your face. bait hanging around but we've been casting for hours cab dog did not get any big hits at the front here bad luck eh maybe next time we're gonna go back to camp start packing up and if we see some action at the front then we can cast for that but yeah see what happens eh Ew. we're just there for some reason I thought I had the small top water lure on, but it's not. Ah. Big mosquito. Hopefully not on the reef. No. Right, tried nothing. Nothing. I wouldn't say good, but it's refreshing. <laughs> Probably wouldn't even say refreshing, but it's coffee. <laughs> Alright, it's time to pack up. A couple of hours of getting picked up. So, pack down the tent and then clean up all the fishing rods and everything. Put everything away. Ew.
Yeah, look at that edge. Look at the boat moving. Crazy. Oh, look at that. We're stuck in a whirlpool. If you fell in here, you'd be so gone. <laughs> Why do you want to go for a swim? Oh. <laughs>